uh, second win here in Cage Warriors. How does it feel, man? Second one done. Feels great. Feels great. Getting closer to that um, title shot. Hopefully, we get it next. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what's next for me. Quick turnaround tonight. You made pretty light work of Tin. Like, what what did you kind of expect coming into the fight? Because uh, you're both uh, Bama champions heading in, but yeah. you know you, tonight in Cage Warriors fighting at 155. How, how did that feel? Yeah, well. Uh, um, I was, he was doing exactly what I, what I expected. I knew he was not going to go to the ground. I knew that he was not going to wrestle. I knew that he was going to try and, and stay long and, and just um, throw straight shots. And yeah, he did well. He caught me with two, two shots at the start, but then uh, that woke me up. So uh, I ended up uh, taking over after that. You're wearing a balaclava into the arenas these days. What does that kind of represent? And you're talking about he's the second man down. What, who's on this list? Well, all the welterweights are on the list. Um, <laughs> I'm coming to take over. I'm coming to be the champ and the champ for a long time, you know. Um, the balaclava just represents me and uh, my persona in the cage. Outside of the cage, I'm Alex Lowry. In the cage, I'm the killer kid. Alex, how happy are you with cage warriors in comparison to how you are with Batman? Oh, you know, it's, 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 it's much better, you know, um, they treat me much better than, than what Bama was doing. Uh, the opponents are, you know, better, stronger, I think, for me. And um, also the, um, the, what's it called, um, oh, I forgot the word. Um, <laughs> the atmosphere, the atmosphere is better and um, the, the Man, <laughs> sorry. I mean, the, um, what's the word again? The promotion, is it that you're talking about? The no, the thing? promotion, the, um, the viewing, the viewing. So people, the people, platform. the platform, that's yeah. it. That's the word I'm looking for. The platform is better for me. Um, you know, more, more people watch um, Cage Warriors. Obviously, they're connected with the UFC. Um, the fights are on UFC Fight Pass, live on Facebook. Um, and live on BT Sports as well, so it's, it's, it's a good platform for me to be on and show my skills. You mentioned the champion, uh, do you have an opinion of Ross Houston? What do, what do you think of his, uh, his game? Yeah, I think he's tough, but not tough enough to beat me. Um, he's, he's only just started, you know, he's only 7 and 0. Uh, I'm more experienced than him, I fought, you know, stronger fighters than, than, than him. But it'll be a good fight, you know, if Cage Warriors let me uh, get that title fight. I know they're coming to London in March. London is my, is my hometown. You know, you've seen it from when I was on Bama. Every time I fight in London, I bring on a big, big crowd. So I fill up the arena. So hopefully they let me uh, fight for the, for the title in March. Going back and, um, to the fight, you landed some great low leg kicks and then caught him with the right hook. Is that part of the game? Yeah, that was definitely part of the game plan. You know, we knew that he was flat-footed, and he left. He, he leaves um, his, his left leg forward a lot, so he worked on chopping that leg. That was one of the the, the game plan. Yeah. Nicholas Dalby and Phil Peter think that the winner of their fight will go on to fight for the title. Do you feel that your win, your first round win, is enough to kind of leapfrog them if they come away? Whoever comes away with the win in that fight. Will? Well, for me, <laughs> okay, I can't say no, I have to say yes, but I'm not the one that's going to decide that, you know, I let them, um, I let the, the, the Cage Warrior team decide on what's next for me, uh, but I'll be very happy, yes, to, to, uh, to fight for the title next, if it's possible, if they let me. Two down now, I guess, what's the rest of the, what's the message to the rest of the welterweight division? Well, I'm coming for the rest, you know, I've got another three fights on my contract, so make sure you're ready. I'm going to have a week off and I'm back into the, into, the, into the gym training and getting ready for my next victim.